units, please respond to a disturbing the peace situation. Suspects may be armed. probably got drunk and told half the town. Fellas, I got him! Yo! Huh? It's not... Fine. Ah, never mind. You're all tricks. No more tricks. I'll take you on any day. Mono a mono. benefit I almost feel like a bully Many of the petty criminals apprehended by Spider-Man turned out to be wanted on far more serious This just in, webs need something to stick to. just then. Of uh, boredom. The happy faces of residents no longer afraid to walk the streets prove once again why he's called your friend. Time for all turn. <sighs> okay. Don't be nervous. You need information on Craven and you've got a press pass to get it with. Peasy. Never mind that if he finds out you're a photographer and not a reporter, he'll have you stuffed and mounted. Mr. Kravenoff? It's me, Peter Parker, from the Daily Bugle? We, we spoke on the phone? The, uh, Mr. Kravenoff? <laughs> oh, I apologize for startling you. I am Craven. Please forgive my theatrics. I merely wish to demonstrate my skills. The videos online do that pretty well. I saw you take down that Siberian tiger with your bare hands, without hurting it. Tigers are endangered. I simply relocated the beast for its own safety, as well as that of the local villagers. True hunters wish to conserve the natural world. It is where we find peace. 
you're a long way from the natural world. I craved a new challenge. I came here to hunt the monsters Oscorp created. The cross species. The deadliest combination of animal and human. I ended their threat. But I grew fond of your city. And your city grew fond of me. <laughs> and I decided to stay. Except now you're hunting normal people. No! Only criminals. Only those who prey on their fellow man have anything to fear from me. This new task force is sending a pretty strong message. No vigilantes. Ah, I do not trust them. They are paid for by Fisk. I am sure you've heard the rumors of his illegal activities. Sure, everyone has. But no one can prove it. And the police seem okay with him. Because he has paid those who are corrupt. The rest are desperate to avoid looking incompetent. Well, the public is desperate for an end to the crime wave. I have only one agenda. To get results. Based on my experience, uh, research, the police aren't big fans of vigilantes. The police had their chance to stop the crime wave. They failed miserably. I, uh, don't think they like being reminded of that. I do not wish to insult them, but it would be a far greater crime to have the power to help, but to refuse to act. Would you not agree? Yeah. As a matter of fact, I would. Is man really the most dangerous game? In their own way, yes. But men are merely highly evolved animals. The current crime wave provides fascinating opportunities to study them. The patterns of the various factions. And what are you finding out? That criminals are not unlike beasts. They have hunting grounds, specific behaviors. Many travel in packs, but there are differences. Such as? Animals prey on others for survival. Only human beings are willfully cruel. Hmm. So you're saying you feel a responsibility to use your power to help? Yes. To have such power and not use it is to be unworthy of it. Uh, well, thanks. I, I think our readers will find this very interesting. Good, good. I must take this call. But please, look around. Take pictures of anything you wish. Yes? No, I said tranquilizer darts. No, I have no interest in automatic weapons. They require no skill. I am an artist! Couldn't ask for a better picture.
perfection. Pardon the interruption. Would you care to see my latest trophies? Spider-Man captured them. An inadequate solution. They escaped. So you killed them? To save the lives of their victims, yes. But also in self-defense. They were deadly opponents. I know. I mean, I can imagine. When do you consider it okay to kill? When there is no other choice. I do not take life lightly. But when it is necessary, I do not hesitate. If my failure to act cost the life of an innocent person, I could not live with myself. I know what you mean. They all had superhuman powers. How'd you beat them? I have trained myself to the peak of human ability and learned many natural means of enhancement. Not drugs, like the scum who pollute the streets, but the secrets of native cultures. Herbs, potions, mysteries forgotten by so-called civilized man. Hunting criminals? Some people might wonder if you're the Carnage Killer. Uh, he is no hunter, but a brute. A savage. His very existence is offensive to men like myself. So even though he's hunting criminals, you'd like to take him down? Of course. He dishonors what I do. Without honor, Peter, the hunt means nothing. Last question. Is there anything you haven't accomplished yet? Ah, uh, yes. I would like to leave a legacy when I am gone. Pass my training to a protege. My only family is a brother who... Well, he chose a different path. I never had a son, but... Perhaps... Uh, forgive me. I am becoming melancholy as I get older. So, do you have what you need, Mr. Parker? Yeah, I think I do. Is this? That's no way to talk to a lady. Or even me. Felicia, this is the number I gave Whitney Chang. How'd you get it? The name's Black Cat, as in Cat Burglar. As in I get my hands on things I'm not supposed to. How about you, Spider? Do you ever get your hands on things you're not supposed to? I heard you were back in jail. Listen, if you're calling to tease me about breaking out... I'm insulted. I can think of a lot more fun things to tease you about. 
If you're smart, you'll get out of town before I find the time to chase you. Funny. That's what I was going to say to you. Things are getting dangerous around here, Spider. Why don't we chase each other out of town, hmm? I'm too busy to fool around with you. I, I mean, play games with you. Bye, Felicia. someone to talk to. It, it can help to hear from someone who's been through it. Guess I should go check in with my hairy personal trainer, Craven. <clears throat> hey, Spidey! I could really use a helping hand! Someone's in trouble. <clears throat> Can't leave now. People are in trouble. Time's up, it's my fault. And when it's down, everyone forgets I exist. I must say, I've become quite a <laughs> And victim said, if Spider-Man hadn't been there, I don't know what would have happened. Spider-Man, I'm on your side all the way! <sighs> Not sure what I was aiming at there. Hey, Spidey, George Stacy respected you. How about a hand? Now hold on tight. What makes someone decide to be a henchman? 
No self-esteem? <laughs> the shaken victim said, if Spider-Man hadn't been there, I don't know what would have happened. You know, I'd love to know how the task force is going to stop the crime wave when all they ever do is come after me. I knew you would come. Yeah, well, don't get any ideas about me being your sidekick. But I'm on the trail of the Carnage Killer, and tracking's a little out of my wheelhouse. Ah, yes, the Killer. I thought he might be you. But I have watched you, and I see that you are you no spider me? Only briefly. There is much a hunter can learn from observation. I see. The way you carry yourself like a lost child. That you lack someone to guide you. To help you become a man. I have no son of my own. I do not want my legacy to die with me. I can make you the ultimate hunter. Let us work together to... to find this carnage killer and suppress the crime wave. Let us do together what we could not do alone. I'm still gonna operate on my own. Of course, as will I. But we will be there for each other when it is needed. I sent you an address. There is a back alley from which the Russians move stolen Oscorp equipment to a safe house. <laughs> Use the little fish to catch the big ones. Yeah, I've heard that before. <laughs> it is tempting to catch the easiest prey. But in our case, the most obvious criminals are the most inconsequential. Wait. Follow them. See where they go. I get that, but... I'm not gonna let anyone get hurt. If I see these guys threatening someone's life, they're going down. Illegal money is usually paid in cash. If you follow low-level criminals as they drop off their earnings, they will lead you to the next run of the ladder. You are doing well. Now listen. Higher-level criminals prefer to keep a low profile. But just as animals must visit a watering hole, they must collect their money and pay those above them. I'll give them this. The way these guys hustle all over the city, they're getting one heck of a cardio workout. Often the higher <laughs> level criminals will lead you to legitimate businesses that serve as a front to launder the illegal income. It is here you will find their bosses who pretend at respectability. I have to admit, Craven. All this is leading me to the big fish I never used to find before. Thanks. Like a pride of lions, when the leaders fear an outside predator, they will call their soldiers together for protection. And every crook in New York is afraid of the carnage killer. When I find where they're holed up, it'll be like one-stop shopping. You are learning, but stealth is crucial. Even you cannot fight all of them at once.
Excellent. Yuck. Gotta frame the subject better. If we don't have everything ready when the truck arrives, we'll be in big trouble! Gotta get a photo of that crate of Oscorp tech, so I can trace it. If you drop that, I'm not taking the blame for you. Quick, get the crate loaded before someone sees us! Suitable for framing. That Oscorp deck will go to their superiors. Do not lose sight of it. I'll stick to it like, well, me. Lose that truck. It's my ticket to the Russian secret clubhouse. Can't let that truck out of my sight. Craven's tips are paying off. I get the feeling there are a lot of bad guys in there. I better keep a low profile. I'm guessing this isn't a restaurant guy. The Carnage Killer. These must be all the places where he killed these guys' friends. A lot more than the police know about. I know what Craven would say. A clearer picture of the Predator's hunting grounds. So this is where all the cool gangsters hang out. Have you seen it? She 
this keeps up, they'll notice me for sure. It is a sticky, gooey, smelly sweater. Those you like. We need to talk about this level of effort today. It's not good. I'm guessing this isn't a... So this is where all the cool gangsters hang out. Shh. People work around here. Did you hear? Smith is already rich, but he's holding a fan race. Pay for money to fight crime. You want to fight us, eh? Fine. Let's see if he has the stomach for it. Have you seen him? He has the stomach for anything! <laughs> Bad guys don't think of themselves as bad guys, but come on, you must know. Some days you just got it. They're so cute when they're asleep. Now take some time to think about what you did wrong. I'll come right out with some cold water. One time I fought somebody who was a real loser, and they were still better than you. Man, what I could do with equipment like this. Hmm. Harry won't mind if I borrow this for a little while. Before you see me move. Better go see what that was. I have him! Don't feel bad! You're not... You're not... Alright, you're not good. <laughs> Why can't they all be like that? Anyone 
be that fast. Okay, lady, how much coffee did you drink? Did your mom tell you you could be anything you want? Because she was wrong. I'm gonna guess this was not a meeting of the Wilson Fisk fan club. Craven, I'm sending you pictures. The first one looks like a map of places the Carnage Killer struck. Ah, yes. Good. Good. The more we can learn of his habits, the better. Next up is a flyer for an anti-crime fundraiser hosted by Wilson Fisk. I think they're gonna try and kill him there. Even if Fisk is crooked, I can't let them do that. Especially with all those innocent people around. The fundraiser is tonight. They will have put their plan into action already. You must go to the location and stop them. Just one problem. I don't have an invitation. And I'm guessing you don't either. Then we must improvise. I am too well known to bypass security. But under your mask, Spider-Man, nobody knows who you are. Here's a hint. I'm not rich enough to go to this. Then you will find a way. I believe in you. Wouldn't mind chatting with Fisk, see what he knows about all this. But I kind of have a feeling he's not the most approachable guy in the world. And none of it matters if I can't get inside. Wait, I think I've got it. With that fundraiser's level of security, I can't use my press pass to bluff my way in. Unless I'm really supposed to be there. But a photographer needs a reporter. And I bet I know one who's already planning to go. Thanks again for using me on this. Hey, I get it. College is expensive. You want to make easy money taking boring pictures of wrinkly rich people? Go nuts! But you should probably stay away from me. Let me guess, you've got some pointed questions about the task force? Among other things. I give it ten minutes before I get kicked out. <laughs> hey, Harry! <laughs> Pete! <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I, I know we haven't seen each other much since we were kids. But this doesn't seem like your kind of scene. Society pages. I'm a part-time photographer for the Bugle. Smile. Great. Got it. Thanks. Fisk is putting a pretty big target on his back. Why do you think he does it? He grew up in Hell's Kitchen. Lots of crime, gangs. Huh. I think this is his way of taking control. Mm. Standing up to the guys who bullied him when he was a kid. But knowing Fisk, he's also got a plan in place to profit from it. Hmm. Whitney Chang says the cops on the task force are crooked too. I just supply the tech. Fisk handpicked the men. But the police chief cleared them all. The chief's desperate to stop the crime wave. He's not gonna argue with the guy who's helping him do that. Well, one thing's for sure. The task force is getting results. And no one likes to mess with success. Huh. Hey, 
Hey, I gotta ask. Why Fisk? I hear some pretty shady rumors about him. He's the only one rich enough who is willing to work with me. I've got, I've got a lot on my plate. I can't waste time worrying about people attacking Oscorp. And our public image could use a boost. I'll tell you this, though. The rumors are true. Fisk is definitely into some illegal stuff. But good luck proving it. Drinks, gentlemen. Tick, tick. Whoops. Sorry. Uh, you know, don't worry about it. I gotta go anyways. I've got uh, important things to do. Me too. Something fishy about that guy. Better follow him. To my work clothes. No doorbell. Guess I better get creative. From you, nothing. We just need your waiter uniforms, so we can serve Fisk a special recipe. What are you gonna do with us? <laughs> Depends how much you bother me. so surprised. Thank you. I was so scared. I learned a valuable lesson today. Kicking bad guys in the face is fun. Thanks for liberating me, bro. Smashing. Thank you, indeed. Open sesame! Okay, that didn't work. On to plan B. Silly spider!
put forth this weak an effort? I kind of feel like you don't respect me. You are all flesh and no substance. Spidey dance part. Well, more of a seismic blast, really. This is different fighting man to man, huh? What good is climbing walls now? Not gonna happen. You're deliberately moving really slowly? Is this like some sort of mu- No more trick. You want me to let you go? Raise your hand. No? Okay. Well, I saved Fisk from the Russians. Now to find out if I have to save anyone else from him. These people are movers and shakers. I can learn a lot just by listening in. Just what I want. The problem is the gangs have all this. So, uh, this is gonna sound like a bad pickup line, but you seem really familiar. Have we... met? Judging from your bargain basement suit, I doubt we move in the same circles. Oh, I get it. One with a silver spoon in your mouth, huh? <laughs> Hardly. For me, silver's an acquired oh, taste. Um, well, uh, I'm here for the Daily Bugle, so, uh... You know anything interesting about Fisk? I know he hangs out with rich, older men. And you're scaring him off. So I'll have to say goodbye. <laughs> Look me up when you move out of your mom's basement. I don't live with my mom. I live with my aunt. Well, nice meeting you. Um, my name's Peter. <laughs> As if you care. <sighs> but what? Well, he knows how to make an entrance, by blotting out the sun. Time to talk to the big man himself. Isn't it kind of ironic? Hey, back off! Uh, should I tell Whitney Chang he has no comment on the Russian mobsters tied up downstairs? It's all right. I like this young man's boldness. He mustn't reveal that to anyone. It would play into the criminals' hands. They want to make people afraid to support my anti-crime efforts. But if no one knows what they did, they'll get away with it. And try again. Oh, I assure you, they will not get away with it. Meaning what, exactly? <laughs> well, the, the task force will get them, of course. <laughs> We've been gathering intelligence on this organization for some time. But no one's been able to stop them yet. Not the police, not Spider-Man. Don't say that name to me! Spider-Man. He fancies himself a hero. But he's let crime run rampant. 
the police are bound by the laws of probable cause. Spider-Man is not. If he hasn't stopped this scum by now, he's either incompetent... ...or he simply doesn't care. What's your beef with Spider-Man? Seems like you're after the same thing. If Spider-Man is going to operate outside the law, one would think he can accomplish things more... ...expediently. But he contents himself with apprehending purse snatchers. He's a dilettante. A thrill-seeker. Worse than useless. Still, he does seem popular with children. In fact, I recently secured his likeness rights. <laughs> you what How about this carnage killer? Is the task force chasing him? We are interested in catching anyone who commits a crime. But it's a lot harder to find one man than an entire gang of them. And I bet the fact he's killing guys you don't like doesn't exactly bother you. I do not condone murder, of course. But am I shedding tears for his victims? <laughs> no, I am not. Gathering intelligence, huh? Find out anything interesting? The Russians are clever. They operate in cells, each knowing very little about the others. <laughs> When one group is taken down, it rarely leads to further arrests. But someone's got to be calling the shots. Well, they do have a central base of operations. But very few know where it is. Finding it will be another matter entirely. <laughs> it's this very war that will be the end of the gangs. The more they escalate, the harder it becomes for them to hide. Wait, are you saying the Russians are still smuggling guns into the city? Don't put words in my mouth, young man. I'm just a backer. I leave the crime fighting to train professionals. Now, excuse me, I have funds to raise. Uh, yeah, I've got uh, important things to do, too. That map I found showed a lot of Russian mob activity around a trucking company. Seems like the perfect cover for bringing weapons into the city. Today only. Order a truckload of weapons, get one Spider-Man at no extra charge. I'm gonna have to find another way.
in this standoff, people are gonna die. Don't worry, I left it under your pillow. your nostrils open. I almost died just then. Of boredom. Police officers say casualties would have been inevitable without the aid of Spider-Man. 